Let's go. I'm going to show you how to assemble the Aquacom SSB 2010. First of all, you have to hook up the battery pack. It uses eight AA batteries. Eight AA batteries, yes. Sorry, it's going to go like that. Okay, that's hooked up. You're going to drop that down in there. You're going to make sure you get a watertight seal. Does the O-ring need to be lubricated? No, it does not. Do not lubricate the O-ring. Snap that shut. Hook up your headset. This is the surface conversion kit. Hook up your headset. There's your headset. Now this is the tricky part. Your cable fits onto this little dial and the dial is counterclockwise. Once you find where it it drops in. See, it's kind of See, it drops in. Now you got to spin this counterclockwise to make it function. And it will lock. In and you got position. a red light here. And those two metal contacts, the Phillips screwdrivers, do they need to be moistened first? They do not. Okay. Now this part is your transducer that gets dropped into the water on the other end of the cable. You have to drop this into the water. And that does not need to go to the seafloor. It does not, you don't want it to touch the dock or the pool or the bottom. It needs to hang mid-water. Then you talk through this. Put this on your head. Testing, 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 testing. Works. You can hear the static in the uh, headset.